Hi, everyone. It's Chris. I'm a content developer and project management specialist here at N2K Networks. I'm also your host for this week's edition of CertBite, where I share a practice question from our suite of industry-leading content and a study tip to help you achieve the professional certifications you need to fast-track your career growth. Today's question targets the Microsoft AZ-900 exam. I've got our resident Microsoft SME here, George. Hey. He's going to help us out today. Hey, George, how are you? I'm good. Thanks for having me. Absolutely. So today is going to be a little different. We're going to turn the tables and George is going to be asking me this week's question. But first, George, before you ask me the question, can you please share a 10 second study bit for this test? And what do you have for us? Well, for this particular test, AZ-900 is a fundamental test. And I would... Uh, always tell someone who's taking this exam to go through the flash questions. Flashcard questions basically hit on concepts. And there are a lot of flash questions, and especially this is a fundamental exam, and you want to make sure that you go through and understand all the concepts. That will help you with practice test questions, but make sure you go through the flash questions. That's a great tip. All right, I'm nervous. But I'm ready for my question, George, whenever you are. Okay. You, you'll do fine. You'll do fine. Okay. So here's the question. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you for the vote of confidence. All right. <laughs> Which of the following are characteristics of a public cloud? And there are three correct answers out of this. So listen carefully. Ooh, okay. A, is it virtually unlimited storage? B, resource pooling? C, provider manages the network and virtualization software? D only one tenant is supported, In E, the services are always free. So, got to pick three oh, out of those. Wow. I have to pick three. Can you please repeat my choices again? Sure. Virtually unlimited storage, resource pooling, provider manages the network and virtualization software, only one tenant is supported, and the last one is services are always free. So in this case, where I have three correct answers, I'm going to use the process of elimination. And I'm pretty certain that foundationally, a public cloud is built on the principle of having multiple tenants supported. So I'm going to rule that one out first. Uh, the other one that is not ringing true is that services are always free. And since it's got an absolute in there, it, that always makes me suspect in an exam and usually false. So do you find that to be the case in these types of exams, George? Abs absolutely. So anytime there's an absolute, you got to mm -hmm. look at it. Uh, you got to look at it cross-eyed. And you're correct. There ain't nothing in this world free. So services are not free. <laughs> All right. So then my answer is A, B, and C. My answer is virtually unlimited storage, resource pooling, and the provider manages the network and virtualization software. And you are correct? correct. And you were worried about this. I oh. knew you'd get it. <laughs> yes. Thank you. <laughs> Phew. All right. Excellent. So, and thank you for walking us through that because uh, those types of questions I'm sure are pretty typical for the AZ-900. You're going to have three choices that are going to be correct. Out of five that you're going to have to guess? You will have, uh, you will have what we call multiple answer, multiple choice, where there will be multiple, multiple choices you have to pick from. So it can be a little daunting, uh, but uh, if you certainly go through and understand the concepts, then you can certainly master them and make a question easy. And the process of elimination, that also, would that work for Microsoft types it of always questions works. <laughs> that I just used here? It always okay. works. <laughs> Great. That's a great tip. Another great tip. Bonus tip for everybody out there. So thank you so much, George. Are there any other Microsoft exam updates coming out soon that you'd like to promote here? Well, Microsoft's always updating their exams, but we have recently put out our Power BI practice exams for the uh, oh. PL900, which is the foundation Power BI exam, and the PL300 exam. Great. Thank you so much. Appreciate your time today. Thanks for having me. Anytime. And thank you for joining me for this week's Cert Bite. If you're actively studying for this certification and have any questions about study tips or even future certification questions you'd like to see, please feel free to email me at certbyte at n2k.com. That's C-E-R-T-B-Y-T-E at n2k.com. 
If you'd like to learn more about N2K's practice tests, visit our website at n2k.com forward slash certify. For sources and citations for this question, please check out our show notes. Happy certifying, everyone.